Hi, this is Kyle Parker for Expert Village, and I'm going to show you how to set up a mail merge data source in Microsoft Word. And so what I'm going to show you is how to create that list. So first you're going to need to open up a new document. And there's a couple ways you can go about this. You can create a table if you'd like, and then you know if you're using something like name, phone, and this is going to be some type of um, contact list you could fill out these fields like and then once you do this you can simply save your document and then once you've created a new document like a form letter you can import your data source that you've created by going to data and then just pulling this in and then now as you'll see from all those names at the top we've got name phone number email and address the fields that we created at the top column there and word has done all the work for us so now if we want to create a letter you can just throw in name and information that will change each time we create a document will update from our data list that we've created the second way that you can do this is if you don't want to create a separate document or you're not importing it from your email list or some other document that's already been created you can simply go to new data source and then you can put all the fields here's are some of the presets you can remove as many of them as you would like um, to make it simple or complex you could add new field names so say there's something in here that you don't have such as email is not on here so we could do email and then add that field name to the list and then whenever you click OK you will need to save this new document and then you'll get your form that will have all of this that you can create so you can then simply enter all of the data and then just continually adding new and then it will create new records each time such as the ones that we created in the other and then whenever you're done you simply click OK and then all of our fields will be updated with their new information and there you go